you picked art. I'm so excited. I have a book to read to you about drawing. And this book is called Andrew Drew and Drew. What did he draw here? What is that? It is an elephant. You're right. This book was written and illustrated by Barney Salzberg. That means he wrote the words. He's the author and he drew the pictures. That means he's the illustrator. It is called Andrew Drew and Drew. So let's get started. Andrew was a doodle boy. Do you see his pictures? Sometimes they call pictures or drawings doodles. Isn't that silly? It's a silly word. Can you say that? Doodle. That's a funny word. All right. He drew. Look at this line. It's a little curved one way and curved the other way. And drew. Oh, what did we see? What are these? What do you think those are going to be? Hmm. I wonder. I'm being a scientist because I said, I wonder. Scientists always say that. And Drew, what is it? There's a couple things going on there. I hope that pig skateboards pretty fast so he can get out of that alligator's mouth. Andrew never knew. Look at, he's drawing this. What do you think this is? It's a little jagged. Oh, and he's sitting on it. Hmm. What would happen? Oh, I see something's going on. What did you think that was? I wonder if it is what you thought it was and what I kind of thought it was stairs. Did you think it was stairs? Let's see. <gasps> when he began, it looked like stairs at the beginning, but now what is it? Kind of looks like a dinosaur. He began with nothing. Look at this, it's called a blank page. He has nothing on his paper but a line. Oh goodness, he's got a line going now with his pencil. And before he knew it, what is that? That looks like a lot of fun. I love flying kites. How about you? <gasps> Ideas would start to fly. It was a kite and now what is it? It looks like a spaceship, a rocket ship. Andrew thought that making a drawing, ooh, I wonder what those are, was like making magic. Look at that, he has a hat with a rabbit coming out of it. And over here he's got a lot of rabbits that he drew. He drew things that he saw. Oh, I see the rabbit and I see the dinosaur and I see the pig roller skating out of the alligator's mouth. Look at that, what is this called? A dog, he's got a whole bunch of pictures here. Let's see what else he has. <gasps> and things, hmm, <gasps> that he imagined. Imagined means he thought it up. He, he thought about what he wanted to draw, but it wasn't really real, so he imagined something and drew it. Sometimes Andrew drew nothing at all. Just a line, a little squiggly line. Those are kind of fun to draw too. That's because he likes to doodle. He's a doodle boy, remember? But he never stopped for long. He has a gallery, an art gallery going on here. Do you ever hang up your pictures that you draw? I like to hang up my pictures too. Andrew doodled and doodled. Remember, doodled means drawing. He doodled and doodled. Sometimes he noodled. When you're noodling, you're thinking. That's what noodling means. And cock-a-doodle doodled. Look what he made. He made a rooster. When night drew near, as it always does, Andrew knew. <gasps> Ooh, I wonder what that's gonna be. There would always be more to draw tomorrow. I love that drawing. That must be imagined. I don't know if I know a creature like that. So he created this creature. 
I love it. All right, this is the end of the book. This was, this must be the author when he was a little boy. He's doodling. I wonder if this book is about him. I don't know, maybe. I'll we'll have to look him up, I think. All right, now that I read this book, I want you to go into your pencil box and grab your pencil and grab your journal from your bag because your journal is going to have paper inside of it. When you open it up, choose the first page and I want to see what you doodle with your pencil today. All right, friends, go have fun, draw your picture, and have your parents share it with me. Bye.